Today at Ignite, one of the things we're focusing on is security. According to the UK government's 2022 Cybersecurity Breaches Survey, around four in five of boards or senior management within UK business rate cybersecurity as a very high or fairly high priority. So with that in mind, we're pleased to be joined by security expert David Okeode. David regularly speaks on the subject and is the author of two books, Microsoft Azure Security Technology Certification and Beyond, and Penetration Testing Azure for Ethical Hackers. Well, David, thank you so much for have, well, having us. <laughs> We're having you joining us. Yeah, thanks for having me. Yeah, it's lovely to see you, and um, I hope you're having a good Ignite so far. It's been amazing. So it's been amazing just attending the sessions, listening to a lot of um, awesome speakers, um, very, very interesting announcement, especially around security. Yeah. So looking to unpack some of them today. Yeah, so... Well, what are your first impressions from all of these announcements? I guess it's going to be on the security side, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, and for me, I think it's been very interesting to see security take the center stage at Ignite. Yeah. Um, to your point earlier, it reflects what we're seeing in the industry. About 81% of UK business and organization leaders consider cybersecurity to be a core priority to them. And a lot of the announcements that we're seeing at Ignite reflect that. So organizations that are transitioning to the cloud need to protect um, identity and access. So we're seeing a lot of strengthening of identity and access security. So I love the announcement around a phishing resistant um, MFA that's been um, added to Azure AD. So in terms of certificate-based authentication support, I think that's um, a great response from Microsoft um, um, to recent threat patterns that we've seen in terms of recent breaches that have been successful. Um, I also love the fact that um, just workload identity security have been protected more. Again, we've seen a lot of threat patterns that, that yes. leverage some of those. So in, with regards to Azure AD identity governance mm -hmm. now being extended to workload identity so we can now have conditional access for workload identities, access review for workload identities. But then if you take that further to securing data, we have confidential computing now being extended to more Azure services like AKS that developers use to um, build cloud native applications or to run cloud native applications and also to user computing with Azure Virtual Desktop. Yes. So overall, my impression is that this has been a great ignite for, for security. Absolutely. And so many things to help enable productivity and be more secure, which I think is really key yeah. um, when you're delivering security because it's been a barrier for so long. So um, I think it's amazing to see what we're doing. So, David, what role does security play in helping organizations to adopt the true power of the cloud? Because we're yeah. seeing a lot out there. Yeah. Um, and that's very, very interesting because the role of security itself does not change. Mm -hmm. And what organizations are implementing just purely on premises, um, hybrid cloud leveraging the Azure platform with Azure Stack. Mm -hmm. However, the approach that security teams are taking is rapidly evolving. Yes. And part of that is due to um, the unique challenges that organizations face when they adopt the cloud. Um, so for example, we're seeing a lot more in terms of shifting security to the left. Yes. So security team democratizing a lot of those capabilities. <laughs> Let's see that. So security team dem uh, democratizing a lot of those capabilities um, to um, development teams at yes and infrastructure teams. So we've seen announcement yesterday relating to um, capabilities in GitHub Advanced Security now being brought into Azure DevOps, which is where a lot of yes, organizations are. big, want. big announcements on this. So David, yeah. there's a lot more about security I think you and I need to touch on. Yes. So for everyone watching, I would like you to reach out to myself and David on Twitter and LinkedIn. We're gonna do a little bit of a video. Um, it will be coming out after Ignite on all the security updates. So I'm gonna queue up with David to do that. But unfortunately, as much as I want to talk about security for probably the rest of the day, because it's my, part of my DevOps, my DevSecOps practice, right? So we need to talk about what's coming up at 2.45. You're going to join us on the keynote stage for an amazing session, illuminating the threat landscape and empowering that digital defense. Well, it's time now for our live UK keynote, which looks at the two core components needed to drive growth and innovation using the cloud a digitally skilled workforce, and a strong cybersecurity foundation. Here's Microsoft's Paul Kelly live. Please welcome Director of the Security Business Group, Microsoft UK, Paul Kelly.